Well, you're about to be looking live at the CenturyLink field testing site, which reopened this weekend after a Christmas break. Now, testing was on the rise before the break, and the site will close down once again for New Year's. But that doesn't leave travelers much time if they do want to get tested ahead of the holiday. NBC2's Gage Golding is live there this morning. And Gage, judging by our live look just now, it looks like they're gearing up for a busy day. Yeah, good morning. Gearing up for a busy day is an understatement. Yesterday we stopped by and the parking lot was nearly full. Today already looking to be the same. Actually, take a look at this video from earlier this morning. This is when we arrived just as the testing clinic was opening around 8 a.m. Cars lining six miles Cypress Parkway waiting to get in. Many of these people say they're getting tested because of the holidays. Some because they don't want to be the cause of an outbreak. It's proactive. I was tested a week ago. I'm getting tested now uh, just to be on the safe side, and I've been self-quarantining for two weeks. You don't want to uh, be the uh, cause. You, you want to be proactive rather than reactive. Yeah, if you're looking at that line, you might be thinking, wow, this must take forever. It's actually the opposite. It may look like a lot of people, but they get through that line very quickly. If you want to get tested today, there's just under 1,800 appointments available for Monday, about 2,600 appointments available. Live in Fort Myers, Gage Golding, NBC2.